Embracing Masturbation, a Wellness Approach. In a recent AARP article by Ellen Uzelik, the benefits of self-pleasure were discussed as part of the overall healthcare well-being. The reporting significantly focused on benefits for the aging populations. One man, age 83, shared his journey of rediscovering his sexuality after losing his wife. Through uninterested in dating, he sought ways to fulfill his desires, and experts suggest that masturbation could be his, quote, happy place, unquote. Certified sex therapist Nan Wise emphasizes the health benefits of solo sex, from improving heart and mental health to fostering a deeper connection with the body. Sexuality educator Tamika N. Harris-Jackson supports this, noting that masturbation is a normal, healthy behavior. For those curious about enhancing their experience, experts would recommend tools like vibrators and male sleeves. Ultimately, WISE encourages individuals to embrace masturbation as a path to sexual well wellness, turn it into a practice of self-care. Well, listen, we always talk about self-care, right? Mm -hmm. We need that, but, you know, I'm very sex positive and I'm like, if that's what it takes, um, I'm happy for them. They need to explore that. The benefits of that is, I mean, you, the anxiety, yeah. you're relieving stress. There's a lot, they've proven lots and lots of benefits from, mm -hmm. from masturbation. Yeah. And no one's ever gotten pregnant from masturbation and <laughs> no one's got an STI from it. So, right, right. right? And, so how, it's healthy. and how Alan was saying before about quoting RuPaul's, right? If you can't love yourself, how you expect <laughs> right. anybody else to? You know what I mean? Like, right. you know, again, nobody knows your body like right. you do, mm -hmm. right? And sometimes you just want to get to the prize and not have to talk and all that beforehand. Let's right. be real, right? Yeah. And if you want to be kinky, right? Oh, I'm not going to give away my secret. Forget it. <laughs> okay, I will. I will. I will. I will. Think about someone who's taken while you're doing it right and like the most taken person even makes it more exciting That's okay right. michelle obama oh I, <laughs> <laughs> oh I always think about michelle hey. obama. That's <laughs> with them strong arms oh, I love um, her. yes we have big big fan of masturbation oh. um huge <laughs> proponent uh practicer of it um phd phd i've been doing it for a very long time um but yeah it's very important i'm i'm happy to know that no matter what age you can also you can always find a way to rediscover your sexuality it's very very important the day that you lose sex or sexuality or satisfaction in that way is the day you die so honestly make sure you keep up the good work to whomever this man was, I don't know why you would talk to a person about this, but I'm glad you did. Because yeah. you're going to inspire so many people yep. at your age, like everyone at this table, to oh. continue to do the exact same wow. thing. So we are very, very proud of you. And they are so looking forward to masturbating because of you. Right, Alan? Sure, for sure. Thank you to the right? AARP for writing the article. <laughs> right? 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 You know, people are constantly saying how older people are ornery, right? And they're mm. sour and they're not in a good mood. This might change right. the whole game. I mean, think about it. Like, you know, after you orgasm, you're all red. You feel all good inside, right? You talk to your freaking enemy at that point, right? Like, come on. that Right before a business, like a meeting, you should masturbate. Like, what in the car. What did Bonnie did before she got here? That's what Hello, she did. Yeah. I knew where I was coming. <laughs> no. And where I was coming. <laughs> For sure. <laughs>